Okay, so I'm um, setting up problem number four using Solver. I'm going to go over here, copy it over really quick. Um, I can worry later about how many to do to make that look better, but I just want to get where I can see it now. Okay. So on that one we have the um, Cohen brothers problem and as I go through, like the first thing I want to do is read the problem. I'm going to work it as I read it. But Cohen Chemicals produces two types of photodeveloping fluids. Black and white picture chemical, so I'm going to call black and white the black and white chemical and the color. Okay and then I have the cost per ton which I would just call the cost for now and it specified the cost per ton of the black and white was 2500 and the cost per ton of the color was 3000 Okay. that gets rid of the first one. Based on analysis current inventory levels and outstanding orders, um, at least 30 tons of black and white and 20 tons of color must be produced. So quantity needed. In addition, the manager notes the existing inventory of a highly perishable raw material must be used to avoid wasting the expensive raw material. It must produce at least 60 tons total. So the total chemicals used needs to be greater than or equal to 60 tons. And let's see. So the quantity needed up there is the um, black and white and the color and greater than or equal to greater than or equal to and 30 and 20 okay now we want the lowest possible cost at least 60 so I need to get a total there to make sure that I get at least 60 and then our cost on that we'll need because we have to minimize that good there and let's go through and give this a shot to see how we go let's do there go to my solver and my objective is for my total cost to be minimized by changing the amount that I order subject to the constraints of the total chemicals used 
has to be greater than or equal to 60. The black and white quantity has to be greater than or equal to 30. And the color quantity has to be greater than or equal to 20. Everything looks fine. Let's do linear. And when we look at that, we see that the quantity is 40 of the black and white, 20 of the color. Intuitively, we knew that because we had to get to 60. Um, and since we want to minimize the cost, then we knew that we'd order as much black and white as we could with the minimum amount of color, which was 20. So that just makes sense um, intuitively. So um, what's the optimal quantity of chemicals? So our answer is... We always want to answer the question, the optimal quantity of chemicals to have the lowest cost subject to the constraints given is tons, be sure and put the unit, uh, so 40 tons of black and white chemicals and 20 tons of color chemicals. Okay, that looks good. So I'm going to go ahead and save this. And um, that's a wrap.